it's interesting the the paper that you've you've done there um because you've done something which most papers don't do a lot of the papers previously to this they don't allow time for adaptation yeah um i think some of the studies that louise burke references are three weeks on low carb with uh not adequate protein or electrolytes which is a common sure. problem when we gravitate yeah. into low carb because insulin drops and insulin is the main uh, well insulin will pull sodium back into the blood when it from four points in the nephrons in the kidney so it, when we go low carb insulin drops and this releases uh, sodium so there is a requirement for some sort of supplementation especially in the early phases yeah. in regards to sodium um, and these studies have never accounted for that but i mean you've you've addressed this in this study um so could you could you talk us through how you've gone about doing this the adaptation yeah. process and potential supplementation yeah so it's a, the difference between our study and louise's is that we did randomized controlled trial in other words we use the same 10 people on both sides of the experiment on all sides of the experiment and so that was the same people now what louise did was she had a group of elite athletes and she invited them to choose which diet they would follow. And that is doesn't that means it's it's a hypothesis generating study. It's not proved causation. 